this morning light is easily one of my favorite parts of this apartment. It's so gorgeous. I think my plants love it too. <laughs> Recently, I discovered this daily wellness um, playlist on Spotify, so I've been using that in the morning to just wake up and has some really nice positive affirmations. After my shower, I love to use this lotion by everyone for everybody. It's a natural lotion. It smells so good. And then I also use the Moroccan Argan Oil by The Ordinary on my face in the winter, and then the Q10 um, cream under my eyes from Nivea and of course some sunscreen. Love these little lush skin tints. One's a highlighter and one is a bronzer and these are really nice in the winter because they don't dry out my skin. So here's my outfit of the day. It is this cute turtleneck. It's really comfy and then I have my Levi's which I need to fix the waist because this literally always happens to me. Um, I don't know if you guys get that too. Uh, but they are super cute, really light wash Levi's. They're not white. I know they look white, but they're not. <laughs> so I just wanted to pop in a little disclaimer here to mention that I have a dentist appointment this morning and that really helped me get going uh, and get out of bed early. The days have been getting shorter. It is darker outside right now, um, earlier in the day, and I have definitely been feeling quite sluggish lately. Um, and I know from asking on Instagram that a lot of you guys have been too. One thing that I will say though, is that I always do prioritize my workouts and meditation. Um, unless I'm like very, very tired and I cannot find the energy, I will usually have a workout, even if it's just like a 10 minute run, if that's all I can manage. Um, it really does help my body and I would highly encourage you guys to um, get a workout in if you can. Um, but do go easy on yourself because I think we handle the stress of the pandemic in different ways. Um, and I think our bodies are definitely more tired right now because they're just coping with so much anxiety and confusion. And um, I think we need more sleep and we need to just kind of take it easy on ourselves for that. So. Um, yeah, I just wanted to mention that and I should probably get going because I'm going to be late. This is Nala's morning routine right here.
All she needs is a cardboard box and she's happy. Something that's been helping me maintain a sort of positive mindset recently is journaling and just writing down things that I'm grateful for or just kind of reflecting on some things that are on my mind. Um, I take a few deep breaths and just try to like get present before I journal and then just kind of write down things that I'm learning, things that I appreciate in my life. Um, anything like depends on the day, but um, I think it just kind of helps me like feel grateful for my life in general because I think right now, especially if we're home alone, it's easy to look on social media and think that other people are doing better than you or, you know, just coping with the stress of everything can be difficult and I totally get it. Um, so just kind of putting things down on paper helps me clear my mind a little bit in the morning and feel happy about where I am in my life and just grateful for the little things. Now it's time for breakfast. I'm very much a savory breakfast kind of person, uh, especially in the winter. I really don't like to have smoothies or oatmeal or anything like that. I really prefer like a salty kind of savory breakfast. So my go-to is an avocado toast with a organic free run um, egg on top. And that is just very satisfying for me and just like helps me feel full until lunch. If I'm feeling anxious one morning, I will take a little bit of CBD oil. This does not have THC in it. Um, and this has really helped me just kind of cope with anxiety and everything this year. Um, it doesn't, like you don't really feel anything, you just feel a lot more calm and collected. So when I need to, I'll take a little bit of this, but I'm doing pretty good this morning, so I'm not gonna take any right now. Next, I take about 10 to 15 minutes to meditate, depending on the day and how much time I have. And then I will dive into work after that. And my mornings usually look like admin work, um, answering emails, trying to figure out what my goals are, um, anything like that. But um, I usually don't get to painting until like 10.30 or 11 um, on a good morning. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe so you can see my future videos. And as always, let me know if there's anything specific you want to see. And hopefully this gave you a bit of inspiration, but remember to take it easy on yourself. It hasn't been an easy year and our bodies do need time to recover. So if you're having a hard time, you're not alone. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.